Hi everybody, it's Carla. It's Friday, May 30th, and it's been a while since I've made a video. But I wanted to show you something that I was able to win on auction at eBay this week. Uh, if any of you watch Southern Sweeties Reborn Nursery, you'll recognize the sculpt of this doll. It's the An Ming by Ping Lao. Um, she had one, and uh, she sold it uh, when she was getting uh, some silicone dolls that she wanted. And this is not her doll, but I fell in love with that little sculpt when I saw it. She always uh, dressed her so pretty, and she was just a sweet little armful. And so uh, over time, I've been um, looking for this particular doll. Now, I know Irresistibles, I think, sells a kit. Um, but the kit is expensive, and I just never had the money to, you know, spend out a lot to get something custom made or anything. And so I would watch eBay, and I think I've saw two or three of this sculpt come up, and um, all of them, at least the ones I saw, were selling around five to six hundred dollars. And so that was a far off dream that there is no way, no way I could ever get this doll. And um, so I just always looked. Well, a few days ago, I think around the 27th or something, I was, is about mid-morning, and maybe that was the key. Uh, not a whole lot of people were on there. My son had told me, if you ever want to look for something, always make your first choices for filtering, uh, ending soonest. And so I hit ending soonest, and up popped this beautiful little doll that was just about 10 minutes away from her auction being over. And um, I will go back down here and show you what her original uh, listing showed. Now this was the listing, and this was where we were at when I spotted her. Uh, it was only at that point, it was at 151.50 was uh, the bid, and the high bid. And there were six other bidders on there. And I had been selling some handbags and some, um, uh, like, other little, you know, personal items on eBay. And so I had a little bit of a bank up of money that I could maybe use, but I couldn't go over $160. I just couldn't. So I put in a dollar more, so it brought up to $152.50. And then I really quick, about two minutes before the auction was over, I put my high bid in at, uh, because at 152.50 it said I was, now I was the high bidder. And so then I put in $160 as my maximum bid. And I thought, well, if it's meant for me, I'll get it. If it's not, oh well, but I'm not going over $160. So it clicked down and about a minute away from the end of it. Sure enough, you know, I looked and nobody was moving on this. It was still everything and I'm still a high bidder. And I just watched the clock tick down, and about two minutes before the end, I thought, boy, somebody's going to come in and snipe this out from under me right at, you know, two minutes, and nobody did. And when it clicked down all the way, I had won this little beauty for $152.50 with free shipping. And yes, she's used. It says right there, used as new condition was on display in the cradle. And it, her listing says, reborn baby Kim Lee from the Ping Lao sculpt on Ming, Asian baby with human hair. So let me read down here what the seller wrote. This precious baby is Kim Lee and she was created from the on Ming sculpt by Ping Lao. She is 19 inches long and weighs 3 pounds 9 ounces. She has human hair from an Asian neighbor of mine. I am not the original reborner but she was painstakingly made to my specifications by Adrian Anderson of Dare to Dream Nurseries. She has big dark eyes that just capture your heart at first glance. She also has pierced ears with tiny gold ball studs. Each little crease and crevice has been painstakingly highlighted as pictured. She will come home to you wearing her Minnie Mouse sleeper made by Disney babies and adorable white lace trim socks. She comes with her favorite little teddy and her soft pink blanket. She is in excellent condition as she has been lovingly cared for on display in her own little cradle in my bedroom. Due to downsizing, I am forced to put her and her big sister Esther up for adoption. See separate listing for Esther. And I did go to see the other listing. And Esther is a beautiful baby. She had wrote too that that was her first reborn and that she was in gently used condition. But this one was in like new condition 
and this was something that I had been scouting for and looking for for months, months and months. So I just was, I felt I was just so fortunate to uh, be able to spot this and to win it. It just blew me away. And so it came today, Friday, the 30th, and here's the Certificate of Rebirth from Dare to Dream Nursery, where no dream is out of reach. This certifies that Kim Lee was reborn at 10.02 a.m. on the 10th day of July, 2012. Weight three pounds, nine ounces, length 19 inches. Sculpt on Ming by Ping Lao. Artist Adrian Anderson, your baby is one of a kind and will not be exactly duplicated by me. She also included the artist's um, original care instructions, and then she sent me a, a personal note. I hope you enjoy your new baby to keep her hair in place. I occasionally missed it with warm water and put on her stocking cap. So along with the baby, she sent this nylon that was cut out and fit over her head and protected her earrings and her face paint. And of course she was wrapped in a beautiful little pink fuzzy blanket that she talked about. Here's her little uh, teddy bear that was included, her little lacy white socks, and she was wrapped in a nice pink plastic bag. So she came priority mail, and I was so appreciative of how well that the seller wrapped her. And um, just to give you a glimpse into those gorgeous eyes, you can, there's, the color fills the eye socket, just to the very tip on either side, you can see a little bit of white, but it's basically all this beautiful dark eyes and these little uh, berry colored bow lips right there. She's got flushing to her cheeks. It looks like she's either been outside or she just woke up from her nap and her little pinkish nose. And she's got little um, scrunchy wrinkles in her forehead like she's in deep, deep thought. And there's that beautiful human hair that she was talking about getting from her Asian neighbor. And the person that rooted it, she put a beautiful little swirl there. And there are no missing spots for the hair. It looks just like a baby from behind. And she's got beautiful hands, beautiful feet, and beautiful bottoms of her feet. You can see right there. And a beautiful little hand right there. I'm running out of battery life on my phone, on my uh, camera, so that's why I'm kind of hurrying through this. But I just wanted to say that um, I was just so thankful that I was able to get her. She's just so, so pretty. And um, to give you the, the hint that, you know, look for the things that are almost ready to end, you know, ending soonest listings. And then, like I said, if you happen to be home in the middle of a day or a certain time of a day that's kind of a downtime on eBay and, and look for something, you might just be able to capture it because evenings and weekends are just loaded with shoppers and that's probably not, it's going to be a fight to get the one you want. But this one I just kind of lucked in on the last uh, seven, eight, ten minutes of her listing and was able to get it and I am just thrilled to death. So I will come back with um, more videos of this sweet baby. I'm thinking of her another name. I don't think I want to keep Kim Lee. That was her other name. I was thinking of Lotus because that's an oriental flower that fits in all the oriental cultures. And each one has a different actual uh, oriental name for the word Lotus. And there is one called uh, Pema in Tibetan that means Lotus. And um, I thought of that, but it might just keep the English anglicized version of it and call her Lotus. But I will let you know that in a future video, and when I get this little baby all dressed up, uh, I will show you how she looks, okay? Thank you for watching. I really appreciate everyone. And uh, I want to thank Southern Sweeties Reborn Nursery. I don't think she's on here anymore, but if anybody knows her, let her know that I appreciated seeing her beautiful baby, and that inspired me to keep my eye open for this beautiful little baby. And um, thank you, everyone, for watching, and take care. I hope you have a great weekend. Bye.